Many students failed this particular question, but it is a very easy question. Okay, now let us solve it together. Welcome back to my channel. Today we are asked to solve for a squared plus b squared plus c squared divided by b squared minus ac if a plus b plus c equals zero. Now, first, let us write this out. So we are told that a plus b plus c is equal to zero. Now let us square. Let's square both sides. Okay, let's square both sides. Now, if we do that, we will have a plus b plus c all squared is equal to zero squared. Now, a plus b plus c squared is a squared, okay, plus b squared, plus c squared, plus 2ab, plus 2ac, plus 2bc is equal to zero okay so this is what we have when we expand this now remember that look at the question okay we are trying to manipulate this to look like this right so in this question we are told a squared plus b squared plus c squared we have gotten it here so we won't touch this again we are not going to touch it again we are now going to try to manipulate the remaining part of this uh, equation right to get b squared minus ac that is what we are going to do now first of all let us factorize two from this side so we have a squared plus b squared plus c squared plus two brackets when this is divided by two we have a b okay plus when this is divided by two we have ac plus when this is divided by two we have bc is equal to zero now remember look at what we have we have ac here we have gotten ac here so we are not going to touch it again yes do you understand we're not going to touch it again we are going to use a b and b c to see how we can get b squared from there so we can write a squared plus b squared plus c squared plus two bracket let's bring this and this together and take this to one side so that we don't touch it so we have a b plus b c plus ac all right is equal to zero now if you look at this very well this a b and b c you will notice that we have b they have b in common so we can write a squared plus b squared plus c squared plus two open brackets now let's factorize b out here a plus c right all right that is, see what I did. A, B divided by B will give me A. And B, C divided by B will give me C. All right, plus A, C. Remember, we are not going to touch A, C. Is equal to zero. Now, how do we get B? Because what we have here is B squared. That means what we need here is B. How do we get B to multiply this B to give us B squared? Now, let's come back to this equation. Remember that we are told that A plus B plus C is equal to zero. Now, let's see what b is if we transfer b to this side we are going to have minus b right so we have a plus c is equal to minus b can you see that we can replace a plus c with minus b and that will definitely give us b squared yes that is where i'm driving at but before that if this is the first time like you've not come across this channel this is your first time it's time to click the subscription button turn on your notification bell so i don't miss our amazing videos we upload several videos daily always tune in at your convenience to watch our new uploads give us a thumbs up if you're actually enjoying this video thank you very much all right now let's continue so we are going to have that a plus c is equal to minus b so we are going to replace this a plus c with minus b okay so we have but a plus c is equal to minus b now we have a squared plus b squared plus c squared plus 2 into b brackets remember a plus c is minus b right then plus ac is equal to zero we are getting there all right now let's continue we have a squared plus b squared plus c squared plus 2 brackets now b times minus b will give us minus b squared so we have minus b squared plus a c is equal to zero 
okay um let's continue let's continue all right now let us open this bracket but before we do that let's transfer this to the other side of the equation okay because the equation says a squared plus b squared plus c squared divided by b squared minus ac is equal to what i'm sorry i claimed that so we write this this will give us a squared plus b squared plus c squared is equal to now plus two or and whatever that is attached to it we cross become minus two right so we have minus two bracket minus b squared plus a c all right now we have a squared plus b squared plus c squared is equal to let's open this bracket minus two times minus b squared will give us minus minus is plus so we have two b squared now minus two times plus ac will give us minus two ac all right now we have a squared plus b squared plus c squared is equal to remember that we are looking for b squared minus ac so let's bring it out from here and to do that we need to factorize these two out okay so let's bring out these two two b squared divided by two we give us b squared minus two ac divided by two we give us ac can you see anything now let us divide both sides of this equation by b squared minus ac let's bring this to this side okay so if we do that we have a squared plus b squared plus c squared divided by b squared minus ac divided by b squared minus ac is equal to two brackets b squared minus ac okay divided by b squared minus ac are you seeing anything now b squared minus ac we divide itself to give us one so it simply means that a squared plus b squared plus c squared divided by b squared minus ac is equal to two and this gives us the final solution thank you so much for watching see you in my next video bye